Yes. So tell that story. It's an incredible story. I'm filming you. Yes. So um, back in 2000, uh, Amanda Milan, who was, yes, yes uh, her, um, I organized her memorial um, and uh, it, at, um, at MCC Church. And from there, we had a march. Um, and it was really, the, I don't know if you were there, um, it was, uh, the whole thing was uh, really a watershed moment in trans history because it was the first time you had all in one first room. First time. The first time you had all in one room, politicians, the press, and street prostitutes who were getting up and giving their testimony right. on what they went right. through every day. Right. And, and they, tell them what happened. Um, so, uh, we were do, going to a march to where Amanda was actually murdered at 42nd and 8th. And the police were very specific. We were not allowed to cross the street. We could not go to the site where she was actually killed. Well, Reverend Pat was leading the march. And I, I had the megaphone. Yeah. Um, and everybody was following Reverend Pat. And she just ignored the police barricade, pushed it aside and took the march right where the police told us not to go. Oh. You know, because I was working as the police liaison. I had the megaphone and I'm trying to yell people, no, come back, come back. Nobody's listening to me. Everybody's just following Reverend Pat. So I was like, okay, let me just go with it. And the cops surrounded us um, and started getting tasers out. And uh, I thought for sure they were gonna shut this down any moment. And uh, the one thing that I wanted to do was uh, read a list of the names of the dead which this was uh, before Remembering Our Dead came to New York City. So this was the first time the list had been read publicly. Um, and I wanted to at least get through the names. So I just grabbed the megaphone and I started reading. Um, and uh, I got the to- The names and the dates, right? Yeah, the names, uh, the dates, uh, the, the age, where they were from and how they were killed. And uh, there were about five pages only at the time that we had. This was in 2000. It was like really one of the first compiled lists. So um, I'm just reading the names. And I got to Marsha P. Johnson. And the crowd went wild. And everybody screaming and clapping. And, and I'm just going on and reading the names and the facts with each people. And everybody starts screaming at me, Jamie, Jamie, stop. Jamie, look up, look up. And I'm thinking any minute I'm going to get cracked over the head with a baton, you know. So I just kept reading. I wouldn't look up. And it wasn't until I was done when I had read Marsha's name, there was a rainbow that peered over us in the sky. And it wasn't even a full rainbow. It was like a square. It looked like a gay flag. Incredible. And everyone saw it. That that was uh, the Marsha miracle. Yes, the rainbow. Over what a great story. <laughs> Isn't that great? And now, now to be on YouTube.